Sprogs Network. Hi, I'm Emma, and welcome to the Sprogs Network, where every day we're creating fun and educational videos for kids, children and toddlers. So don't forget to hit subscribe. Today we are again joined by Steve from the zoo, who will help you to learn all about frogs. Hi Emma, it's great to be here again. So let's get started with some fun facts about frogs. Fact number one. There is evidence that frogs, like this little guy here, have roamed the earth for more than 200 million years, at least as long as the dinosaurs. Next, there are over 6,000 species of frogs worldwide. Scientists continue to search for new ones. 6,000? Gosh that is a lot. Toads are also frogs by the way. The word toad is usually used for frogs that have warty and dry skin, as well as shorter hind legs. Look at this toad. There is not much difference between frogs and toads, and they are not classified separately. This is because the toad lifestyle, with its dry, rough, skin, is an adaptation to living in drier habitats. Check this guy out, having a little swim. Frogs are amphibians, which means they're able to live on land and in water. These are amazing facts. Are you having fun? Next, frogs live all over the world. If a foreign species of frogs is introduced to another country, the local ecosystem might be affected. Also, frogs can live on land and in fresh water. They cannot survive in salt water. Great fact Emma. And just to add by the way, frogs don't actually really drink, they just kind of soak it in through their skin. And they can breathe through their nose, and their skin. These facts are amazing. Are you having fun? Next fact. They have striking characteristics, as you can see here, like protruding eyes, webbed feet and their skin is smooth and moist. Their eyeballs assist them in swallowing food, they push the food down their throat by pushing down the eyeballs. Their vision field is almost 360 degrees so they can see all that is around them all the time. Nice. They do need to live near water, as their skin must constantly be moist. If it dries out the frog dies. Yes, most of them obviously therefore live in water, but some species of frog weirdly do actually live in trees or burrow down into the ground. Just look at this guy. Wow, that's so cool. Frogs have very strong back legs, designed to help them leap and swim. As you can see here. They catch their prey with their tongue. A frog's diet also varies depending on its species. Some eat insects and other worms, while others prey on other frogs, small rodents and reptiles. Many poisonous frogs, such as this one here, are boldly colored to warn predators of their dangerous toxic skins. So what about baby frogs? Frogs have a fascinating life cycle. Female frogs lay fertilized eggs and these eggs then hatch into frog spawn. Between 6 and 21 days later, the frog spawn hatches into tadpoles. Here you can see just that. Frogs typically lay their eggs in the water. A group of eggs is called a frog spawn. The eggs hatch into tadpoles. That's right Emma. Tadpoles as you can see here have no arms or legs, only tails to help them swim. It takes about 6 to 9 weeks for tadpoles to become fully grown, though this varies between species. During this time, they swim, eat, and grow. After about 12 weeks, the tadpole grows its legs and arms. Its body gets longer and its head gets bigger. It starts to be able to breathe underwater too. At this point, it also still has a tail. Finally, adult frogs eventually do lose their tails. And so all in all, it probably takes between 12 and 16 weeks for the frog to go from those eggs, right through to full-grown adult like this guy. And again, adult frogs can jump with their legs, or swim like this frog right here. And remember, they have long tongues that they use to catch bugs. They make a sound called a croak. Some species live in trees. Can you see this little frog sat up on a branch? That's just about it from me in this video. But one last fun frog fact before I go. Most frogs are green, brown, gray, or yellow. But some are brightly colored, like this frog right here. That's just about it from Steve and myself Emma for today in this video. We do hope you enjoyed these frogs videos for kids full of fun facts about grogs, and don't forget to hit subscribe below to enjoy loads more fun educational learning videos for children and toddlers from here at the Sprogs Network. Bye for now, and we'll see you in the next video.